Imagine a scenario in which you eat a very large sandwich with a large piece of bread. That bread is going to get digested very quickly. So now you're going to have a higher load of glucose entering your bloodstream. The blood glucose is going to go up. Insulin is going to be released in proportion to the amount of glucose that is in your bloodstream now. A few different things can happen with your blood glucose. You can have a very, very big peak. And then because your pancreas has put out a large amount of insulin, it will fall, right? And sometimes it'll fall really quickly depending on how much insulin is produced. Say you swapped that bread, right? for a higher fiber bread. Instead of white bread, you choose a whole grain bread. It may even have the same amount of glucose. But what's going to happen is your stomach and intestines will digest it more slowly. And now the blood glucose is going to enter your bloodstream more slowly. So the pancreas is going to sense a smaller amount of glucose and release less insulin. It doesn't mean we have to eliminate carbs completely. Yeah. It just means we have to strategize.